The presentation of Gift 2 begins by comparing the wood sphere with the yarn ball of Gift 1. They're approximately the same volume, but made from different material with different sensory and other properties. For Froebel, the sphere represents wholeness and is therefore the source of all geometry that comes later. The sphere is explored and contrasted and compared with the cube. The cylinder appears as a mediator between the sphere form and the cube form, combining properties of both curved sides with flat surfaces. If you move a sphere in a straight line through space, it produces a cylindrical pattern in space. By spinning a cylinder using the hanging apparatus, a child can observe a spherical pattern with optical illusion that also ties the sphere as the origin of the cylindrical pattern, which can be observed by spinning a cube on a certain axis. Of course, these ideas are too abstract for very young children. Nevertheless, they offer concrete experiences with these abstract forms, which create a foundation for later learning. The solid shapes make excellent play pieces with stories and games for younger children. The spinning of the gift, the two solids, would be a form of knowledge activity. While the number of pieces is limited, a child can use the box and solids to create forms of life and string and spin the solids in various ways to observe patterns for forms of beauty.